third Sunday of Advent, Gaudete Sunday. Brothers and sisters, throughout the world, we celebrate this third Sunday of Advent, preparing for the coming of the Lord, also known as Gaudete Sunday. The word Gaudete is Latin meaning rejoice. Rejoice, for the Lord is coming. From that same word, Gaudete, we have the word Gaudium, which is joy. Joy and rejoicing go hand in hand with patiently waiting for the Savior, because we know that the greatest of all great things is coming, the source of everything. God himself is coming to be with us. This weekend, we learn again from John the Baptist. Let us hear what he can teach us about joy and rejoicing in the coming of the Lord. From the Gospel of John. There was a man sent from God whose name was John. He came as a witness to testify to the light so that all might believe through him. He himself was not the light, but he came to testify to the light. The Lord invites us to live in the light, to get out of the darkness of sin. Sin is the greatest thing that robs our joy. Satan is the thief of all of our deepest longing, all of our deepest pleasures, our deepest happiness, the deepest joy within our heart. And sin is what Satan uses to put us in the dark and to steal our joy. John the Baptist came to testify to the light, to tell us that false pleasures will not bring us joy, but only Jesus Christ. He himself was not the light, but he came to testify to the light. Continues. This is the testimony given by John when the Jews sent priests and Levites from Jerusalem to ask him, Who are you? He confessed and did not deny it, but confessed, I am not the Messiah. And they asked him, What then? Are you Elijah? He said, I am not. Are you the prophet? He answered, No. They said to them, Who are you? Let us have an answer for those who sent us. What do you say about yourself? I am not the Messiah. John the Baptist, to carry out his mission to bring the light to the nations, to share the joy of the gospel, had to know that he was not the source of salvation. He was not the Messiah. Sin steals our joy. And what is sin? Sin is a refusal of God's grace, turning away from love. Sin is being who God did not make us to be. In other words, living out of a false identity. Sin is a lie. John the Baptist knew who he was, and John the Baptist knew who God was. I am not the Messiah. Who are you? Who are you? I am not the Messiah. I am not Elijah. I am not the prophet. John the Baptist had his identity rooted in God, not a false identity. A false identity is another thing that steals our joy. If we strive to be somebody that we are not, we will never find the joy that we are looking for. Let's hear what else John the Baptist can teach us about joy on this Gaudete Sunday. John the Baptist said, I am the voice of one crying out in the wilderness. Make straight the way of the Lord, as the prophet Isaiah said. Now they had sent from the Pharisees. They asked him, Why then? Are you baptizing if you are neither the Messiah, nor Elijah, nor the prophet? John answered them, I baptize with water. Among you stands one whom you do not know. 
the one who is coming after me. I'm not worthy to untie the thong of his sandal. This took place in Bethany across the Jordan where John was baptizing. The last point that John the Baptist gives us, the last thing he teaches us so that we can have true joy is to recognize that one greater than us is coming. In other words, we do not have the ultimate control of our life. We are not the ultimate source of, source of our pleasures. We are not the ones that can give ourselves joy. It must come from something outside of us and must come from something greater than us. God has made us for perfect and infinite happiness, which means no passing pleasure in this world can bring us joy. Friends, this weekend, we celebrate Gaudete Sunday. We are just one short week away from celebrating Christmas, the birth of our Lord. In order to be ready for His coming, we have to be vigilant and alert. We have to be waiting. We have to know who we are, which comes through silence and solitude. And above all, we have to be joyful, waiting with patience. We lose our patience, we lose our joy when we feel like we are losing control. But in the end, God is in control. So therefore, we surrender it all to Him. We give thanks to God for John the Baptist and all that he teaches us throughout this season of Advent, especially this third Sunday, Gaudete Sunday, when he teaches us that joy is a key characteristic of every Christian. And to truly have joy, we must not pursue false pleasures. We not, must not pursue a false identity. We must not pursue false control, but only the true Lord, the true Messiah, the true King who is to come. Behold the Lamb of God. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Go in peace.